Despite a record-setting career, Dion Butler played in the shadow of Derek Williams' big-time rep. He stepped into the spotlight with a 4-3-8-40 at the Combine. You'll see why his stock is rising on Draft Guys TV. Dion Butler broke Bobby Ingram's career receptions record at Penn State in 2008. He started as a freshman and went on to lead the team in receiving yards every year of his career. Butler's 40 time isn't surprising when you watch him play. Watch again as he gets up to speed right away. He's fast in and out of his breaks. Butler is also sudden enough to turn a defender around as he breaks, and again after the catch. Here, Butler gets a step on Morgan Trent, who sells out to catch up. When Butler breaks off the route, Trent is powerless to stop the catch. When the threat of his speed causes a DB to open his hips early, Butler takes advantage. A review of Butler's hands yields mixed results. Sometimes, he's a natural hands catcher. He looks comfortable catching the ball over his shoulder. But sometimes, body catches or fights the ball. And occasionally, he'll have an ugly drop but you don't get to be your school's all-time reception leader unless you make the catch when it counts. Butler is little, but it doesn't stop him from being physical. He's a willing and sometimes very effective blocker. As a receiver on this play, his quicks and speed get him open, but the ball is underthrown so the DB can get his arm between Butler and the ball. Still, Butler outfights him and makes the big play. You're watching Draft Guys TV here with Dion Butler, wide receiver Penn State. Dion, how's it going, man? Uh, feeling pretty good. It's good to be back out here in this nice weather. Uh, definitely better than State College, so it uh, feels good to get out here in the sun and just mix it up with some great players. You are very into forensic science. So tell us about the internship that you had when you were actually on crime scenes. Uh, that was actually a Philadelphia homicide unit. It's just, um, I mean, it's a shock. You know, you get kind of caught up in your little college world up there in State College or anywhere, wherever you're at. And, you know, you just come out there, and I was in Philadelphia seeing, you know, the homicides and kids that were my age or younger and just um, on a daily basis. So it was definitely, you know, something that um, I was very interested in, but it's just kind of a, you know, a setback to reality, you know, on how, how tough life really is. Deshaun Jackson, Eddie Royal, and Donnie Avery showed size isn't everything in their breakout rookie year of 2008. Look for Dion Butler to continue that trend in 2009. For more information on DraftGuys TV, go to DraftGuys.com. <laughs>